In this video, we'll explore Miami, from its sandy beaches, unique neighborhoods, modern skyscrapers and Art Deco architecture to the vast Everglades. This travel guide is based on our exciting trip to Miami. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel and share your Miami experience in the comments below. Miami lies in the southeastern part of the US state of Florida, between the enormous tropical wetlands, the Everglades and Biscayne Bay Lagoon and Marine Preserve. It is practically located in the Caribbean, serving as a great entry point for all the fantastic vacation destinations. One of the most original places in Miami is the world-renowned South Beach. Stroll along Art Deco District and Ocean Drive and learn about Miami's architectural history as you admire dozens of uniquely designed buildings, cafe-style dining and boutique shopping. With over 800 buildings, Miami is home to the largest collection of Art Deco architecture in the world. South Beach is known for its stunning sandy beaches. South Point Beach, with unique colorful lifeguard towers, is a popular surfing spot. Stop at South Point Park, a beachfront park with lush palm trees and hiking trails, or walk on a beautiful pier with views towards the beach and the city. Rent a city bike, explore the area and stop at one of many restaurants and beach clubs like Nikki Beach, visit Miami Beach Botanical Garden, interesting museums and art spaces, or Lamas Park an outdoor exercise area popular with fitness enthusiasts. If you want to spend the whole day relaxing at the beach, a visit to Key Biscayne is a must. Located just a short drive from downtown Miami via an impressive causeway, formerly a coconut plantation, Key Biscayne is a haven of lush parks, golden beaches and quaint neighborhoods. Key Biscayne is also known for hiking and biking trails and the historic Cape Florida Lighthouse with amazing views. Besides, the island is also a waterfront paradise. Whether you like surfing, kayaking, water skiing, jet skiing, supping, snorkeling or just spending an afternoon on the boat, there is an abundance of activities to choose from. With all the sun and activities, no wonder sunscreen was invented in Miami. Especially popular during the spring break, Miami is also one of the top US party destinations and venue of famous festivals and other events. No visit to Miami would be complete without experiencing its many unique neighborhoods. The vibrant Calle Ocho, center of Cuban life and culture in Little Havana district, emerged mainly after Fidel Castro took over Cuba in 1959. Many Cubans migrated to Miami and first settled in this area. Calle Ocho is now famous for authentic Cuban food, traditional Cuban cigars, ventanitas, festivals and live music. Although English is the official language, more than 60% of people living here also speak Spanish due to extensive immigration from Spanish-speaking areas. Little Haiti is another great neighborhood where you can experience authentic Haitian art, music and dance, especially if you visit Little Haiti Cultural Center and its Caribbean marketplace. Almost 30,000 Haitian Americans live in this vibrant community, formed in the 1980s by the Haitian diaspora in Miami. Don't leave the neighborhood without tasting authentic Caribbean cuisine like Chef Creole. Are you traveling to Miami and struggle to find relevant information? We've collected everything you need before you go and when you're there in our mobile-friendly PDF Miami travel guide that covers things to know before you visit Miami and the top 20 things to do in the city, including maps, links, itinerary suggestions, opening hours and other information. By purchasing our travel guide, you are also helping us sustain this channel, so a big thank you for that. Wynwood is known as South Florida's arts hub with over 70 galleries and museums. This former manufacturing district is now a space for creative minds, graffiti artists and painters and is most commonly recognized for Wynwood walls. This interesting urban project started when a developer and art patron Tony Goldman decided to turn the neighborhood into a cultural oasis. The ever-changing murals make Wynwood a living area overflowing with art, culture and innovation. Miami is also known for excellent museums, such as Philip and Patricia Frost Museum of Science, featuring an interactive exhibit, a three-level aquarium and one of America's most high-tech planetariums. 
the nearby Perez Art Museum Miami impresses with 20th and 21st century international artworks with indoor and outdoor spaces. And Vizcaya Museum and Gardens, located in Coconut Grove, an Italian Renaissance villa, reveals its signature Miami flair through tropical elements such as palms, orchids and Cuban limestone, transporting us back in time to the early 20th century when it was built. And coming up next, did you know that Miami was founded by a woman? Miami's modern history began with railroad construction in 1896, when a businesswoman, Julia Tuttle, founded the city and lobbied for the railroad construction. In fact, Miami is the only major US city to be founded by a woman. Soon after incorporation, Miami has experienced rapid growth and also many ups and downs. From bubble burst in 1925, hurricane in 1926, population growth after Fidel Castro took over Cuba in 1959, to becoming one of the country's largest transshipment areas for cocaine in Latin America and, consequently, major violent crimes in the 1980s. Because of its rapid growth, Miami earned the nickname the Magic City, because so many new buildings were constructed in such little time, it seemed like magic. In the 21st century, with over 23 million tourists each year, Miami remains one of the world's most popular vacation destinations and is one of the leading business centers. The city constructed one of the largest skylines in the United States. Visit Miami downtown, offering beautiful walkways with stunning views of the Miami River and skyscrapers. If you like open-air shopping, hop on free mass transit, metro mover and stop at Bayside Marketplace with over 150 shops and almost 40 dining options. Miami offers a myriad of other shopping venues, from Brickell City Center, also located in downtown, to design district with modern architecture, luxury fashion and jewelry boutiques. Coral Gables, famous for the Miracle Mile shopping district, is also home to theaters, lush greenery and the famous Venetian pool. Lincoln Road Mall in South Beach is another excellent spot for shopping, dining and entertainment. Miami and its surroundings cover a large area of South Florida. You can embark on a guided tour or rent a car to explore one of many South Florida's national parks, beach areas or botanical gardens, such as the Fairchild Tropical Botanic Garden spreading across 83 acres. The garden offers a vast collection of over 23,000 tropical plants, a rainforest and even an exotic butterfly house. Don't run away just yet, we'll explore the enormous Everglades by airboat. Spanning over 1.5 million acres in southern Florida, just outside Miami, Everglades National Park is the largest subtropical wilderness area in America. It is home to many rare and endangered species, including the American crocodile and Florida panther. For the ultimate experience, you can take the airboat tour and cruise around this stunning landscape and even pick up a baby alligator in one of the sanctuaries. If you like animals, there are plenty of spots ideal for encounters, from Miami Zoo with over 3,000 cageless animals, Sequorium, home to the famous dolphin Flipper, to Jungle Island featuring flamingos, or Monkey Jungle, home to over 300 primates. Whether you like outdoor adventures, luxury shopping, exciting museums, lush greenery, or delicious food, Miami offers endless possibilities for anyone who visits. Explore the main attractions in the city in our top 10 things to do in Miami.